my kitchen sink is clogged. Uh, I tried the vinegar and soda, it did not work on this one. So I decided to try a chemical recommended by my friend. Uh, he said this is a really good one and it should clean the cloth. So because the vinegar did not work, it means which means uh, uh, I um, kitchen got clogged like really hard somewhere down there. Um, you see the water is not going here. Okay. Now, um, normally kitchen sink uh, the plug the clog happen in this one like this this one called P trap. Okay, normally it happens on this one. So now I'm not sure where is the problem. Is it this one or down, uh, further down? So to diagnose that, uh, I'm thinking to open this one. So I will open this one. If the water come out forcefully, it means there is no problem in here. Like water is not, this thing is not holding the water. It's clear water is coming all the way and which means uh, the problem uh, underneath like uh, further down so I'm gonna check this open this one now see if the water come and if if the water doesn't come then problem is here so this either this chemical will work if it doesn't then I have to open this one and change it and um, if uh, this thing is clear, water come all the way, then I'm gonna put this one back again, close, uh, close it, and then um, use the chemical, okay? And that chemical is very, very, um, very um, strong chemical. Um, you have to put this one, like three quarter of this, uh, in the sink, like uh, straight to the hole, okay, and um, uh, leave it for five minutes. Then run cold water. If it doesn't work to clear, like uh, open this clock, then I have to rent a snake uh, from uh, Home Depot or Lowe's, and then I'll. Uh, run that snake inside the drain and clean it and that is that is a bit expensive that's why uh, i am thinking to use this chemical which cost only under ten dollars and if it works it's nice less hard work and uh, less money so let's see i am not a plumber uh, i just learned this uh, through youtube and talking to my friends Kind of dark in here. I hope you guys can see a little bit. The water coming. Don't open all the way. Uh, let the water come out first. Now slowly open. So that means this pit trap is clean because all the water coming this way and getting out from here so the problem is underneath after this one here you go i opened it okay now i'm gonna close it again Make sure it's tight. 
because I'm going to put the chemical this time. So here is the chemical. I bought it from uh, Rona. Uh, the name of the chemical is Albert uh, Liquid Drain. And drain opener. So it's very, very strong. It's uh, wrapped with a plastic bag like this. It comes like this in a store. So I'm going to open it. Just uh, cut it. Or maybe I just uncut it. open it uh, anti-clockwise push it and open it anti-clockwise like this and make sure use uh, gloves because this is uh, uh, make sure it doesn't touch your skin or any metal surface okay so metal surface it will uh, touch a little bit so make sure you uh, Pull that straight to this hole, okay? both of them. So it's like a one third of the chemical you, uh, you pour into both holes. Here you go, uh, it's open. Okay, now I'm gonna pour it very carefully straight into the hole. Okay. So you can you can save the rest for next time. Just close it really tight. So now uh, we have to use uh, wait five minutes, and after five minutes, run cold water, not hot water. Okay, make sure cold water. Okay, five minute five minutes is over. Uh, now it's time to run the uh, cold water. Let's see how it works. I hope it's gonna work. It's kind of stinking here because of the chemical. like it did not work okay so I'm gonna repeat the same procedure this time instead of five minutes I will uh, keep it 15 minutes and try it again hopefully it's gonna work well uh, did the second treatment this time I kept for half an hour um, it did not work so I think chemical doesn't work all the time. Probably only for peat trap. If like a very light uh, clogged, then it works. Otherwise not. So I have to do now the final treatment, which is run a power snake inside the drain and clear the clog. So I'm gonna do that now. So, so uh, the chemical did not work, still uh, water is plugged, not going in. So the final treatment, which is uh, run a power snake 
inside the drain to open that clog underneath here okay the lower part so here is the drill I uh, just rented from Lowe's okay. uh, it didn't cost much uh, only for four hours 20 uh, like 30 bucks okay so here's the drill I'm gonna plug that thing in, in the power and uh, run that inside the drain I hope it's gonna work so to uh, use the snake in here, I have to open this thing uh, because I run some water. So there uh, is some water inside the pipe. So I have to empty that pipe, uh, empty those water. Uh, then I'll run the uh, snake. Here we are emptying the water without making a big mess. Uh, after I empty the water, I'll run the snake inside this hole. So the water almost emptied, so let me open it, take the water away, put it here for now. So I'm going to put the snake in this hole and uh, try to run the snake as far as I can take down. Here is the snake. Uh, so let's a little bit. Try to put it in by your hand a little bit. Try to use the uh, thick gloves, old gloves, because it's kind of dirty, and all the thing, don't use plastic gloves or medical gloves, uh, your hand will get stuck. Push, push it in as much as you can. That's it, we put all the way, all, almost whatever snake we have inside. Now, uh, run the snake like for five minutes, few minutes, just to confirm that um, everything is done. So anyway, I ran like uh, five, six minutes and um, now it's time to take this thing out. So how do we take it out? There is a small switch here to reverse the, that, uh, reverse the chain, okay, the cord. So snake will come back and if it doesn't come back automatically, you just pull it out with your left hand, same time you reverse use the power button to reverse okay so I put the switch to reverse get done now I'm gonna take it out so we are pulling out the snake so how far did it go here you go all came out hopefully we uh, open the clog we're gonna check up up this uh, sink right now before you uh, check uh, open the sink the water line up uh, in the sink make sure you close this one otherwise all the water will come out and big, make big mess and make sure it's tight it doesn't Let's check the sink now. So I open the 
sink. Let's see if the water. You can hear the gargle sound. When you hear the gargle sound of the water in the sink, like the hole, water going down, it means your drain uh, is very clear, very clean, no problem at all. See? It's beautiful. I love it. Uh, half an hour of work, hard work. Everything done now. Thanks for watching, guys. And if you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you. Uh, before I end the video, I want to uh, tell you something from my experience. Um, to open a drain, I think you should not depend on any kind of chemical. It doesn't work properly. Probably it works only until the pit trap. But if it's, if it's like a really hard plug, depend on the snake. See, this is the best thing, 100% guaranteed and it doesn't cost much, you don't need to buy this. Uh, go to Lowe's or Home Depot, you can rent it like a, under 30 bucks for 4 hours and within half an hour everything done. Thanks for watching guys.